we started a discussion with Ineos in uh, November 2023, where they asked us for a, a new vessel to transport CO2. And from that time onwards, we developed this vessel together. So EU has a goal of storing 250 million CO2, uh, tons of CO2 by 2040. That's a very ambitious goal. And for, for Ineos to be able to support that goal is quite important. And actually you can see this is actually a first step into that, but a very vital step because we're showing it can be done. We show that this is possible. What's special? Well, from people looking from the outside, it's just an ordinary EasyMax, same as the, uh, as the previous four that we built. Most components for the CO2 will be inside and not visible. Only on a later stage, when she's uh, on the outside location in the harbor from Del Seil, then you will see that we will also add some items on the main deck. And it's the first gas carrier with DP2. So that also implies that we can now offload CO2 offshore, which is now mainly done terminal terminal. But with this innovation, we can uh, unload CO2 offshore. Project Green Sand is a green project which is about uh, supporting the green agenda, so storing CO2. And what it's really about is to establish all the way from capture to storing CO2, where transport is what we're watching today, which is the really central part in the, of connecting the two dots from capture to store. Speciaal aan dit schip is dat er nu aanpassingen worden gedaan die uiteindelijk het vervoeren van CO2 mogelijk maakt. Uh, hier komen we wel weliswaar geen luiken op dit schip, maar er komen nu tanks in. Dat is voor ons toch wel weer een andere, andere tak van sport, weer toch weer een uitdaging in het algemeen. This has been very important because uh, I would say that without this innovation, without this solution where we are really doing something a bit first time for EU, it wouldn't have been possible to start the CO2 capturing that early and also storing. So it is really of the essence that we can find innovation together and start new solutions, otherwise it wouldn't have been possible.